We did it. We did what they said we couldn't do. Best is, we did what they said was impossible. Grammy nominated. Grammy nominated. Grammy nominated. We did it. Oh my God. Jesus. Oh my God, I'm a dumpling today. Mama, I have to put on a pet dumpling for me today. Yeah. May I tell you? My ass, my son, my run. Baby, bestie, we did what they said was impossible. I said this last year, 2020, and I must say it again. When man said no, God say yes. Say yes. Amen. Let me just say it again. Because my best system, no say, I said this 2020. When man say no, God say yes. Say yes. What I did today is not, not normal. You know why? Because they said it would never happen. Because they said it was impossible. I am just the living testimony to you guys out there that anything is possible. Best is, I love you. I love each and every one of you. If I could just travel the earth and hug each and every one of you, who I see cry on the internet for me, who fight for me, who speak this into existence, who told me that this was possible. Yo, they said it would have happened. I love you guys. Shaggy, you're my hero. I know you're tired of here. I tell you that I love you. But I'm going to tell you today again, Shaggy. I love you. I appreciate you. You're my hero. There's a lot of people to thank. And I'm going to take my time. I'm going to go through them one by one. Because even though all the people fight me, and even though all the people bring me down, there's so many people out there who love me, who push me, inspire me, who believed in me. And today... I'm Grammy nominated. Hold on. Let's play this again. Well, my people, you're here for yourself. Spice, Grammy nominated. Yeah, man, Spice herself. Grammy nominated, is it? Yeah, big up Spice, you know? Yeah, man, hard work. Yeah, put in the hard work for anything you want in your life. You will get it. See what I say? All right, my people. I have more things I want to talk to you about, you see what I say? And I have uh, at least one more video that I'm going to present to you, my viewers and subscribers, alright? Yeah, and if you're new to my channel, don't be afraid to click the subscribe button and click the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I post a video. <laughs> yeah, alright, so I'm going to move on to another topic. Now, my people, I got some information about an incident where it is said that the body of a 40-year-old woman had been found at her home within a country that is known as Antigua and Barbuda on the 22nd of November the year 2021. That is Monday, the 22nd of November the year 2021. It is said that uh, the deceased goes by the name of Zorina Benjamin and it is said that she is or was a custom officer within the country that is known as Antigua and Barbuda and uh, it is said that uh, the deceased body was found with a bullet wound to the head. See? It is said that uh, her colleagues allegedly noticed that she didn't turn up for work and uh, they tried to find out what was going on with her. They called, they could not reach her according to information that I got and they said that somehow one or maybe more than one of her colleagues went to her home and her body was found. You see me I say? According to a news article that I read, it is said that the police within Antigua and Barbuda said that a suspect is in police custody for the death of the female and that the police believed that uh, the female died as a result of a domestic dispute. See? Now, according to some unconfirmed information that I got and some allegations that have been made on social media, it is said that uh, the female had a boyfriend. And it is said that the boyfriend turned himself in to the police within Antigua and Barbuda and confessed to shooting the female. That would be 
the 40 year old female who died you understand my people that's according to unconfirmed information and allegation isn't it there are also other unconfirmed information that i got where it is said that the police submitted the female's boyfriend name to the airline within antigua and barbuda are basically the airport yes what i mean i say see it now there are also speculations that her death might be linked to other custom officers that had been killed or died within the country that is known as antigua and barbuda yes what i mean i say my people so there's a lot of things being said about this whole situation but me just make no know go on now one of the reasons why me I talk about this whole incident is because someone brought this whole situation to my attention you see me I say and I also saw a news report about this whole situation you see now one of those persons that I saw in the video during the whole news report is a person who goes by the name of Garfield Burford and Garfield Burford used to live within the country of Jamaica to my knowledge you understand or some people might say he's a Jamaican, isn't it? Now, according to some things that I heard in that news report, I got the understanding that uh, this whole situation or incident is the 13th murder that happened within the country that is known as Antigua and Barbuda for the year 2021. Yeah, that's the understanding that I got from that news report. So when I heard that, I said to myself, but wait, 13 murders within that country for the year see and when i do a check on jamaica's murder rate for the year viewers and subscribers we are past a thousand see yeah so them things i all think about but i do not know what i'm going with people so you can tell me what i think about that whole situation all right all right so another topic the next video i'm going to present to you my viewers and subscribers i want to take a good look at this video think and tell me what you think because this video had been posted some places on social media claiming to show two persons who had been accused of being involved in some form of scamming. See? And when I look at the video carefully, viewers and subscribers, some things when me hear and see in the video, I wonder if this video actually shows two persons who are involved in some form of scamming or if the video is some form of a publicity stunt or just for entertainment purpose. You understand me, people? You see, because we see another video that shows the same two persons in the viewers and subscribers. You see, so all of them things that make me start to think if this whole thing is just some form of entertainment purpose or acting or what. You understand? So I take a good look at this video and tell me what they think. Because some of the things I'm hearing in this video don't add up to some things that are being said about the video on social media. So tell me what I think, all right? Now, some of the scenes in this video might not be suitable for everyone. Viewer discretion is advised. Here's the video. Take a look, listen, and observe. Them people are going around and scam people, and I talk about KR, broke down and tea. So, I don't want them to answer them want money for buy gas. You see them? They are going around and I try to trick people. I buck up on them again. Different vehicle may I drive now, so they don't really know what I mean. But I wind down the glass now and I hear what they say. You see it? Hello? What no? Oh no, not a gas? Oh. We're gonna do? We look all the funds but we never got you. You're gonna oh. We are asking somebody if he's an invoice, but I don't know if you can help. Okay. Like how much money now look so? All over we have a box star. All over? Which part of all over? We're fishing village. Oh. Oh. And police station there, you go straight down Pony Road. Oh. And what's your name? What's your name? Karen. Karen? Um. You want me to go buy the gas? Yeah, we're not going to go. We're going to go to the taxi. Eh? We're going to go to the taxi. We're going to go to the taxi. We're going to go to the taxi. Oh, I have a container around here, so man. This can help? One, let me see. Eh? It's too small. Well, you can buy that and we put it in it. Eh. And then, if you can give it the rest, and we put it in a gas station, if you can. Okay, but what am I going to do? The whole time I have a video here, 
I know every time when I go to different, different places and do it the whole time every day. You know, I have a palm video, you have a cell palm video, because you have my sister did it. Yeah, yeah, that's why I'm here to talk to you, son. Yeah, man. I'm here to talk to you, son. Because my sister left you, that's why I trick you, man. So make you hear what you have to say, you fucking idiot. Yeah, man, yeah, man. You forgot to me, you see, man, out of all of them, man. You're in the book, you know. Yeah, man. You said she left you, you know, make she left you. Yeah, man. Because you did a near my head patches and she left your blood clot. Yeah. Wicked, you know, mind your picnic. Yeah, yeah, man, in the fan video. <laughs> now, my people, you know, listen to me carefully now, you know. See? Be careful of scamming, you know, because it's real, you know. You see, me have a lot of persons out there that do all different kind of things in order to gain or get money from people and a false pretense and them things, you know, my people. You understand? So, just in case if this video really and truly shows two persons who are involved in scamming, I want to be careful, but at the same time, I just want to tell me to think about this video and think. You understand? Tell me if you think this video actually shows two persons who are involved in scamming or if you think the video is just an act. See me? Let me know what you think, my viewers and subscribers. You understand what I said to you? But, I can't help but think about what the woman said in the video. You hear what the female say? The female said to the person you hear in the background of the video that uh, something about being involved with her sister or something like that and mind picking. You see me? I say so. Me I say to myself, say, why would the female say something like that to the person who have video record? Yes, me I say to you, my people. See? So I start to wonder if this video is just a publicity stunt. Or if this video is some form of entertainment purpose video. You see me? I say to you. See? We have a thing when we see certain videos on social media, you know? See? So we start to wonder what if the person who have video recorded this video um, some, somehow turn around the whole situation and make it look like a totally different thing than what it is or was. That's what I say. But then again, what if the person you hear in the background of the video is actually telling the truth? See? So I'm not sure straight what you think about this whole thing, viewers and subscribers. See what I said to you? You see it? And look on the motor vehicle where in the video, you know, look at the motor vehicle in the video. You see me, I say, then the motor vehicle, the people, nothing make them, they run out of gas, my people. You see me, I say to you, look at the expensive motor vehicle, eh? Yeah. Anyways, my people, tell me what you think about the video. I guess I'm going to lift it. Big up on yourself, you see? Hey, my you, you know where you watch? Dance, 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 dance. Yeah, man. Hey, yo, skiller. You are watching Dance on Skillet. Tint. Dance on Skillet.